keep it together, Bolt. We've got a job to do here. Now then. Handle him. Ah. At least it doesn't look like they're doing too much to you. Affects that force, you're only taking one damage a hit. Hmm. Still. Should probably send a reinforcement of some kind, just in case. Dorcas should be able to handle this guy over here, no problem. Right? Yeah, that's what I thought. Hmm. Now you need to kill more. Go for it! Yeah! Nicely done. Very nice. Hmm. Should I? Yes, I believe I should. Go for it, Kent! Ooh, smooth moves! Ha <laughs> ha! Even small victories are to be rejoiced. Uh oh. Well, at least they're only doing one damage. I don't know how much more Florina can take, but. As long as I only hit her a little bit. That's good enough for me. Hmm. Wait. I can see it off in the distance. The enemies are starting to thin out. Yes, it's working! Ah, I want to make sure I leave a lasting impression, though. Kill him with your strong spear! Ah, you can survive two additional hits. Maybe even four. I wouldn't push it much more beyond that. You won't even need Will's help. Will's just gonna stand there. What? What are you doing, Will? Get away from Dorcas's wife. Uh, he might be catching that Sane bug. It's a good thing Sane can't hear me right now, otherwise he will probably stab me or something. Ooh! Close! Uh, maybe I'm playing it a little bit too risky. Nah. Uh, yeah, that looks like it. Can Florina take it? Can Florina survive? Looks like she'll do just fine. She doesn't need anybody's help. She can fight all on her own. Well, perhaps with the aid of a forest. To be able to block a sword, just like that one. And it looks like we're done! Curses! They're not human! Listen up, rogues! Retreat! Pull back! The enemy's fled! Bolt! We've won! Wait, you sound surprised! Dorcas! I'm so sorry, Natalie. All's well that ends well, right, Natalie? Our village is close. I'll take Natalie home, and return tomorrow. Hmm? Why can't we just say our farewells today? Well, I... I spoke with Bolt. Yeah, he did. I... I've been invited to join your group. Yeah, I mean, he has... Boomerang Axe. But we're going to Lycia. I have to go somewhere to earn money. If I go, think I'll be of use, I'd like to fight with you. You help my wife. I owe you. Dorcas. Please, Lynn. We are both in agreement on this. Watch over my husband. Things have finally calmed down. We'll continue taking turns. What? Uh, yeah. We'll continue taking turns keeping watch. Please rest easily. Is this all right? Are you sure, Sane? Oh, uh, uh, yes. Of course. Let me warn you. If bandits sneak up on you, they'll cut you down without mercy. Do you understand that? What? Do you doubt my bravery? Am I not a knight? There is no need to worry. Right, Kent? If there's anything suspicious, we'll take care of it. Rest assured. Really? Well, good night then. See you tomorrow, Bolt. Good night, Lindus. Let's go. Ah, no one ever trusts me. And rightfully so. Yeah, well, I'll just write in my journal before we go to sleep. There we go. The next morning comes too quickly. Lin has fought back the bandit's attack. 
Now she rushes for the border of burn. If she can reach it, Lysia itself is not far off. For a moment, Lynn stops to imagine the face of a grandfather she's never seen. Chapter 5, Beyond the Borders! We've almost reached the Lycian border. Once we'll cross, we can be safe from the bandits, right? We should be. I doubt they'll be willing to pursue us across any border. Lycia at last! It's been a long time! Tomorrow we'll dine on a feast of Lycia's finest foods! And the mistress of the inn is crossing is said to be a beauty. Ah yes, food and love, no better way to restore a man's soul. This is going to be a fine evening, eh, Kent? If your behavior is as deplorable as ever, we'd best stay elsewhere. We're not here for sightseeing. Oh come now, that's not fair. Kent, the inn will be fine. As you say, milady. Lindis, you are truly an angel from on high. It's nothing. Forget it. Ah, uh, we'll finally be able to get a good night's sleep. Oh no, those bandits are persistent. I'll give them that much. Uh-oh. Whoa. Ah, here they are. I found them. What? Not again. Ah, uh, they're still after us? <laughs> Don't you think you'd be getting away so easily? You'll leave us. You'll leave alive, and everyone will think of Ganelon Bennett's have gone soft. So? We care nothing for you or your reputations. We must get on to Lycia. Get in our way, and you'll pay. Cheeky little thing, aren't you? Let's get him, lads. And they'll hold him back just because there's wind in him. Wipe him out. Well, what's this? Ooh! We're lost! This makes me so mad! You told me you were certain this path was correct. What's your point, Irk? I was just trying to- What are you trying to say, huh? I swear, you are not the woman I agreed to escort. What? What is that supposed to mean? I heard someone was needed to escort a frail Lycian priestess to Ostia. Yes, and I'm that priestess. Frail? You? Sarah, you have no need of any escort to protect you. Even the most hardened criminal would flee in terror after five minutes in your company. I'll retire your money, gladly. Now, will you please go to Ostia alone? No! You're my escort! Eric, mine! You're so clean and tidy! A noble woman like myself can't be seen without a proper escort! Your personality's nothing special, but you're not bad to look at! I believe that's my line. And I have to take you all the way to Ostia. I only hope my nerves can endure the journey. What are you mumbling about? You're so gloomy. Hmm? Someone's happened to be over there. Let's take a look. Ah, of course. The first opportunity to get involved in trouble and she jumps right in. No amount of money is worth this. Oh. Wow, a fight, a fight! Eric, take a look, fighting those bandits. It's a young girl. Fool, keep your voice down. Eh? What's this? You're in league with this she-devil? Huh? Uh, uh, this is so wrong. Yeah, I'll take care of you with one swift stroke. <laughs> Eric, help me! So, loud. Sarah, behind me! You there, see if you can match me! Hmm. Ha! Take that! That scream! Look out, Bolt! Someone's over there! Oh, I see them alright. But do you see them? Can you reach them? Can you talk with them? Um, excuse me, hello? Huh? Why are you fighting these bandits? It just happened. That's not true. Those ruffians thought we were with you. Now you guys in a terrible situation. Now, how are you going to get us out? Sarah, if you had not been so meddlesome, all this could have been avoided. 
My apologies. Please trouble yourselves with us no more. But, if you're going to have to fight anyway, shouldn't we team up? It will end things faster, right? That's true. Yes, that's a good idea. Eric, go and help these ladies. But I... Fine. Very good. My name is Lindus. Er, Lynn. So tell me, will you join arms with us? Yes, we'd be glad to. My name is Sarah. This is my escort, Eric. Be a good boy and go fight now, Eric. <sighs> oh, I share his pain. I share his pain. 